Today's session will be on the gateway LED panel. The gateway LED panel is now a single piece unit and it's made up of two sections. We've got the fast idle section and we've got the interlock section. Okay, we'll focus first on the fast idle section. This is what we call APHIS, Automatic Fast Idle System. Uh, there's only one active button on this entire panel and that is the engage button. This button serves uh, several purposes. Uh, number one, uh, if the vehicle is not in fast idle and you wish to engage it manually, the vehicle has to be in park and then if you depress this button it will automatically, well manually, put it into fast idle. The second port, uh, function of this button is if you're in fast idle and you wish to disengage fast idle then you'll just push this button and the service brake and hold for about three or four seconds and that'll take it out of fast idle until you actually go through a shift cycle. Shift cycle is when you take the vehicle out of park and put it back into park. Uh, the third function of this uh, engage button is you can manually step up the idle by 100 RPMs uh, on gas vehicles. Uh, each time you press the button you'll go up another 100 RPMs. And then the fourth function of the button is to put the uh, put the system into diag mode. We'll get into the diag mode on the fast idle in a later session. Okay, now we're going to concentrate on the lift interlock side of it. Uh, here again we have LEDs uh, on the top that indicate whenever something is happening and we've got our uh, backlit icons to tell you what those things are. Uh, what we have here is what we call vehicle secure. This is the lift door, park brake, PB. We have a P here for park and then the last one is a lock for the shift lock. Now whenever we engage a certain thing, open the door, put park brake on, put the vehicle in park, we get an indicator up in the top whenever we have lift door open or the park brake will automatically fire the shift lock so in this particular case if I were to step on the the park brake, engage park brake I would automatically turn on shift lock now we have park brake, park and we have shift lock we still won't get the vehicle secure until we actually open the lift door now the same thing is true. If I open the lift door and I don't have park brake set, I will still have the shift lock fired, but I won't have the vehicle secure. In this particular case, here we go. We've taken the park brake off, but we've opened the lift door. Because I have one of these two active, I have actually fired shift lock. Now if I act from this position, if I step on the park brake, then I've had it then I will activate all of the LEDs and of course I will activate my vehicle secure signal so I've got the lift door open park brake set vehicles in park shift lock is fired vehicle secure signal is being sent back to the lift that's your makeup of the LED panel for gateway